Yes! Keep that going and welcome to the stage, George Feller! Hello, Liverpool, how are you doing? Having yeah. a good night so far. Um, I've just got a couple of quick ones for you, I'm new to comedy. And I came out to pretty much everyone I know as a comedian recently, in the last, say, five, six weeks. I told a few people, I'm, uh, I've got a secret to tell you. Now, you've got to be shocked at this. Some of you might think, fair enough, whatever. And a few of them were shocked when I told them I wasn't gay. <laughs> but ones that actually understood that we're doing stand-up comedy said they'd rather see me on my knees choking on this mic right here, right now. And I've just realised I've fucked that up. <laughs> Bit of pressure on that. Um, anyway, I like to travel and I've just come back from Sweden. I say just come back, probably about two years ago. Now, me being the tight-fisted Yorkshireman that I am, I also did it on um, a cheap deal. Now, this is Liverpool. You all know what happened outside an hospital a couple of years, years ago, right? That bloke in a taxi. Same thing happened in Sweden. I got to Sweden on a five-star holiday for £250 for four days, which is fucking impressive, anyone else now? I get it, sir. Perfect. Everywhere real cheap, and that just because of a terrorist attack. I say terrorist attack, he, he pretty much copied the same as what Liverpool did, but did worse some fucking how. <laughs> and staff were really friendly there. Every time they, they're saying, yeah, would you like a drink? Would you like any food? And I don't accent, but I'm not doing Swedish because the way I say it, that's racist. Now, <laughs> now, Stuff were perfect there. I'm actually planning on going back next year. I might have to spend a few more quid, but I actually got Stockholm Syndrome from just being there. <laughs> I'm used to going on real shit holidays, though, you know. Your butlings, your wherever in Spain, somewhere cheap, probably a beater in a pool. Now, I see all these adverts, you know, like all you, all you jet to. They're all, oh, come on, let's, uh, there's, there's a couple like that walking along, along the beach. They're all enjoying themselves. I want to see a working class version for a lad like me from Yorkshire. I want to see it on cheap. I want to see that same couple on there. Fucking come on, let's fucking go. <laughs> I, I've turned up to Spain. I just want to get absolutely rat assed in this all inclusive, paid 300 quid for. Staggering round on second day on a right bastard of an hangover and carrying on like it's his Olympic sport. <laughs> And to be fair, drinking should be our Olympic sport. We're fucking great at it. <laughs> um, I've just forgot all I've got to say. But I also want to see a Butlins version of this, though. It's same old shit. It's your posh families, all in the five-star resorts. No one's really like that, either. I want to see one where it's a £9.50 sun holiday to Ingold Mel's in Skegness. You know, I've just got something now. I want to see um, I want to see a family not arguing as such, but a little kid jumping around it pool like that. Oh, daddy, daddy, what's what I did? I just did a right good jump there. Father's like, listen, Eliza, because posh name for some fucking reason. <laughs> I want to see father stood there like, Eliza, you fucking dare jump in that pool again? You are not coming back in my nine pound fifty caravan. That that pool right there is full of. My piss, fag ends, I'm 98% sure that is a fucking dead head jog. Do not bother doing that again. Anyway, I've just seen it like flashing. I think that's my time. Uh, George Phillips, everyone! Yeah.